I'm Sir Cecil Wellesley Hogg. And I am Dirk Weems, former football star and current sex phone addict. Ah, call me Cinnamon, booyah. <laughs> Joining us tonight is Ewan McGregor. Actor, philanthropist, movie star, UNICEF ambassador. Blah, blah, blah. Just get on with it. Nobody cares. I'm sorry about that. Welcome, you. I understand you've got an announcement about your next project. I do. My next movie is the story of your life, Dirk. It's called Field of Weems. <laughs> I'll do it. Nobody can play me better than me. How much does it pay? Well, they've already got someone to play you, actually. <laughs> Yes, 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 yes. Yeah, no, go back with the thing. Oh, go down. Go back, ready? Yeah. That's ridiculous! <laughs> Nobody can play me better than me. Who could they possibly get? Indeed, who? I don't know. Can play Keep you. Keep talking. <laughs> well, we are. <laughs> <Do ya>? <laughs> <laughs> Respected career. <laughs> Dirk Weems, played by a Scottish pansy like you, you're not man enough to fill my jokes. <laughs> that doesn't worry me, I'm worried about gaining the 75 pounds. Hey! Oh, uh, I'd say it's well north of that, Ewan. Yeah, I'll well just north. wear a fat suit then. What troubles me more as an actor is how I'm going to deal with the. <laughs> <laughs> What troubles me more as an actor is how I'm going to live day in and day out with the shame of being Dirk Weems. Yeah, it's not easy. I mean, there's the drugging and the boozing and then there's all the really disturbing stuff. Hey, well, hey, I was, I was young. I, I had healthy appetites. Yeah, but a drunken brawl in a charity event. Why? Well, those, those kids kept bumping into me. How did you find out about that anyway? <laughs> Our script is based on a spook by your ex-wife. A spook? <laughs> a spook? Yes. I think you meant a book. Oh, I see. I'm sorry. I don't understand uh, the bloody accent the Scots have got. <laughs> All right. So my ex wrote a book. What, Susan? No. Maria? No. Ramon? Ramon? <laughs> I met Ramon once. That is one hot mess. I don't know anything about Ramon. They never told me about Ramon. No, 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 no. no. Look at him now. Not, not so quite, quite so confident now, are you? Hey, eh? ever had a firecracker up your ass? Don't, don't, please, please. Sorry, I went too far. You're upsetting our guests. <laughs> I'll tell you what. I'll upset him. I'll upset him when he gets to the scene in the movie where he has to recreate my infamous, <laughs> my infamous hobo orgy. <laughs> Uh, you in an RG with the homeless? No, hobos. <laughs> Try it again. <laughs> you in an RG with hobos? <laughs> it was the easiest money those bastards ever made. <laughs> and, and the great thing about picking up homeless people is <laughs> you can drop them off anywhere. Have I scared you, Ewan? You've scared me into loving it. That's what you've done. What? <laughs> I had my doubts about this project. Playing a disgusting, washed-up has-been, but you make it sound so dark, so edgy. I can't wait to sink my teeth into it. I'll tell you what you can sink your teeth into. You can sink your teeth into my heart! <laughs> Actually, that might just help. No, no, no! Give away from me, you bloody Scottish bastard! Cut it out! <laughs> That's what you say. <laughs> Cut it out! Exactly! We'll be right back after these messages, everyone.